السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسولنا محمد سيد الأولين والآخرين مدد يا رسول الله مدد يا سيد أصحاب رسول الله مدد يا مشاكل الدستور وإن شاء الله فاز دعسة إن شاء الله محمد ناظر حقاني مدد تاريخاتنا الصحوة والخير في الجمعية All Islam since Prophet وسلم, until now uh, there Allah keep it uh, safe with good people with salih uh, ulama scholar honest scholar There was Allah give them this love for religion for Islam to defend and to be tired day, day and night but not complaining just happy to serve this religion for sake of Allah Of course, there was also Shaitan and his follower trying to destroy this. But Allah, when He wants something, Allah help us. And there was for Muslim for Mazhab. Mazhab meaning way and uh, special uh, teaching. Mazhab, for Mazhab, how can we say? Fifth is uh, not outside of uh, Ahlul Sunnah al Jama'ah. This time, uh, like this. But before each Sahaba, he has his own mazhab, own way, because he was with Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and seeing how Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam doing, he was doing more than 100,000 mazhab. But each one not teaching uh, other people, So at the end, coming maybe hundred one. Also, many of them, because too much people, they not knowing or not uh, understanding. At the end, we have four mazhab, and all in the right way. The people for who are not loving way of Allah, loving shaitan, their ego, their uh, they sought happiness but not happiness, they are attacking this because this is pillar for Islam, our days, Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah, this four mazhab, they are pillar. But now who are claiming they are uh, reformists, they said now Islam becoming old fashioned. We must reform it, we must renew it, we must. Uh, <coughs> Redesign this religion. It is. It is not old house or old furniture. Give for antique people to make clean and to make uh, something. No, it is uh, done by man, a real man, beloved for Allah. Allah. He chose them 
to for this mission because you are in this area following most of here following Shafi Malaysia Indonesia uh, some of India uh, most Arab country there Shafi it is they have millions, hundred millions of followers for Shafi. And Imam Shafi, how he was, he was son, uh, one grandson for one Sahaba. And his mother, she is also uh, from Prophet Sallallahu grand, grand, grand daughter, daughter from Sayyidina Al-Hassan, not Hussein, from Hassan. But his father also, uh, in the same name with the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, is the grandfather of Sayyidina Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And he was born in Gaza, Palestine, you know, but Gaza, everybody now, now famous. But when he was small, very baby, maybe in still not even walking, his father passed away, and his mother, she bring him to Mecca, because family, they was there when he was two year, year old, and six year, she give him to school, one year, he uh, read the Quran by heart, learn to read by heart. And he was real brilliant. In 12 years old, he was giving fatwa in Mecca with ulama, with these people. His mother, she, they, he said, I was uh, in Mecca that time, many ulama, many uh, scholars giving lesson, but we was very poor, he said. I cannot find paper to write. I was writing on uh, bone, this camel bone or something to, to, for to remember. And he said, I hear about Imam Malik, Imam Malik, Mazhab Maliki, he was in Medina. He has a big book named Muatta for Hadith. He said, when I hear this, I was in many, many scholars, I take lesson. And here, when I hear this, I went to Medina to meet him and to ask to get knowledge from him. And when I arrived at Medina, he welcoming me and said to, uh, who are you? I tell them I am coming for uh, take lessons from you. And he said to him, tomorrow come and I will bring somebody to read with you this book. He said, I am knowing this. I, by, by heart, I learned to read this. And he said, tomorrow come. And he was re I was reading for him, big book. He was happy with me, he said. He said, Imam Malik is the most knowledgeable one in Imam. Imam meaning the highest. Every time I say stop, maybe he will tired or he will be fed up. He was happy with me with my reading accent. And he said, read, read, read until I finish this book in one sitting. After this, he, nine years, he take me 
to give me whole knowledge. After nine years, he graduated nearly, he was uh, around 30 years old. And from there, they sent him to Yemen to be judged there. In five years, he was a judge in Yemen. After this, he said, I hear about Iraq. And I went there with his mother. And there, I find Imam Muhammad. Imam Muhammad, he is a student of Sayyidina Abu Hanifa. Abu Hanifa is Imam Azam, the biggest Imam, he said about him. Mazhab Hanafi. His Hanafi Mazhab, also 100 million of people. And he said, I was uh, taking from his knowledge. And he was really knowledgeable one. What I learned from him, I write one uh, camel uh, loud of book from his knowledge. He was very knowledgeable. And uh, his imam, his master, his sheikh, Sayyidina Abu Hanifa, he was enough for to feed all this ulama. And after this, he came again to Medina, Mecca. He was teaching, teaching people, and he exactly know how to make ishtihad, to make fatwa, because he was also knowledgeable for language, Arab language, because he's in Mecca and around this the tribe, they are clear Arabic language. They know, they learn from them. And so he know how to take from Quran, from Hadith. And he was making, taking from, well, he was in taking lesson from Sayyidina Abu, Abu, Abu Hanifa, his, Student Imam Muhammad and Sayyidina Malik ibn Anas, who is Maliki Mazhab, and he look and make this Shafi Mazhab, and everybody was accepting him as Imam. They said his Mazhab also a hack, and so he said for this, because I was uh, seeing Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. When I was young, he take from his Mubarak water of his mouth and put in my mouth. He said, from this, I have this knowledge. So they are respecting Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and they are awliyaullah. They are awliyaullah for this Everybody can many thousands of awliya Allah from his mazhab. Because mazhab is haq. Dagestan uh, people also is this Mawlana Shah Abdullah Dagestani, Mawlana Shah Sharaf Din Dagestani, Mawlana Shah uh, um, uh, Jamal Din Gumukri, all from Shafi mazhab. And so he was, and he take uh, from <coughs> Salim al Rai, he was his sheikh with Tasawuf. And he has big karamat also, real karamat as uh, Awliya Allah doing. Once this is famous, time of Harun al Rashid, he was living, famous. Khalifa. Uh, 
Khalifa, he was taking uh, tax from emperor of uh, Byzance. Taking tax to not make any trouble between themselves, but they was giving a lot of gold and money and uh, prop, uh, something, many things. So they was fed, fed up, and this emperor tell Khalifa, I will send for you 400 priest, monk, to make discussion with Muslim Imam Mashaikh, and if they are win, we will not give any more. But if not we, we don't win, so we continue to pay for you. And said uh, Sultan Harim Rashid, he called said uh, Imam Shafi and tell him, come look what they want. They come and they bring them to a river we call uh, Dijla. There's another name in English, but English also will not, will not know. Tigri, I, I think, something like this. Huh? Dijla. So they come, all of them, near the 400 monks. And Imam Shafi, he come, and he bring his uh, sajada praying carpet, and coming and going to river, and throw this carpet on top of river, and he sit on it, and said, come to discuss with you, he said to them. When they saw this, all become Muslim. This is a real religion. And they was become all of them Muslim. This is his karama, and many karamas like this he has. And when emperor hearing this, what he done with priests, all of them become Muslim. He said, uh, "I am uh, happy. We not call him here. If he come here, all we ask will be become Muslim." So, so is that, and the, of, of course he has power to make all of them all Muslim, but Allah want uh, differencing. Or this, I mean, uh, Sharia and Tariqah, Awliya Allah, all time together. Who not following Sharia, not following Mazhab, they are out of way. Allah will not look for them because they are uh, following their ego. Who can do this? Ten, twenty years to read, to make uh, uh, studying and not giving any importance for money. He also not looking at all for, for money. Once he was coming from Yemen, invited him, and when he come, they give him 10,000 dirham. Coming to Mecca, before entering Mecca, he make one uh, tent, and calling people, I'm, I'm coming, you can come to see me. All, all people, they were loving him very much, everybody coming to him. What they want, they ask, what they want. And there are many poor people also. He was giving them until he finished. He said, oh, 
I am happy now. I am uh, uh, light now, he said. And once some, when he coming from Kaaba to his house, one of rich men give him stand with his servant uh, for him gold in one uh, case back a small bag there was one with him he said when I, I saw him this they give him this and after a while one man coming he said my wife she have baby now and I don't have anything and he said, without opening this, just he give him. And he was like, uh, for dunya, not giving any important, only he want to help. These people who are coming against uh, mazhab, again, to make uh, renewing the Islam, all what they thinking, money because who is saying this somebody give them money to destroy Islam to destroy uh, religion because nobody can reach this uh, ulama uh, what they have in that time Evliya Allah all time can be but for ulama and especially it must be very close for Prophet Sallallahu Sahaba cannot be impossible. And in, uh, after he, this all his life, he went back to Baghdad, but at that time it was too much uh, thing happened in Baghdad. He come to Egypt, and he lived in Egypt, and he passed away in Egypt. But he was also very young. But in, you know, he was only maybe 52 or 53 years old. But all this knowledge, maybe if somebody to want to write this, or to read, even cannot uh, enough uh, time for what he done. This was karama, with helping from Allah, and this barakah of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, what he gave him in his, uh, from his uh, Mubarak uh, water of his mouth. So, this day people who are cheated by this, uh, people against first they said tariqa not good many people they agree with them now they are saying uh, mazhab also not good also some people agree with them after they are saying also Hadith they not accept him now, or even now. So, wake up, so young people, don't be cheated with these people. They are real cheater. They are real uh, munafik. Because our uh, way of Islam, it is not difficult. We say something difficult, they are making people to run away. All, everything, we have ruhsa and we have azima. Ruhsa meaning you can do as much you can do, but there is also, you can do more. You can be rich, you can be poor. But also all of them good. Uh, you cannot judge for these people. You are going for Jahannam, you are going for Jannah. Allah, he will 
asked them, and he know better, not looking for appearance. He know attention, intention, and uh, he know your uh, secret, and you you know his your appearance also. So only Allah Azza wa Jalla can judge, and we are uh, asking people to not judge for anybody. Just we must look for ourselves. Allah help uh, Muslim because in real uh, time, uh, this time, end of time. End of time, everything miss up. But when Mahdi alayhi salam come, everything it will be solved. That time, because Mahdi alayhi salam is representing Prophet sallallahu alayhi salam, that time only one mazhab he will, we will follow. What he done, we will follow him. Tariqah also only one it will be, Mawlana Shaykh said, when he come. But until that, we must follow uh, one mazhab. It is important and it is uh, obligatory for us. Don't be cheated with people. He said, no, I, we are knowing. You, can't, you don't know anything. If you say, I am knowing, the most ignorant one you are. Allah make you ashamed once if you say this. Take your knowledge and you don't know anything. Because we are what we know from knowledge, very, very, very uh, small. Even not comparing to Allah, comparing to this, uh, what he gave knowledge from, for dunya, for this area. But uh, knowledge of Allah, no compare, cannot compare any, even with one uh, atom, no, you cannot say comparing. So Allah Azza wa Jalla help us we are to make our iman stronger and stronger, inshallah. Allah give this country also good knowledge, but Alhamdulillah, we were uh, from beginning, some many ulama, they said for themselves, they are also following new idea, but Alhamdulillah, we see many people, silent people, they are with Haq, with the truth, and they want to speak, we are happy. Many treasure we have in this country, Alhamdulillah. Inshallah, uh, truth every time it will be up. Thank you for you. Wa Allah Tawfiq Al-Fatiha.